Jeez, she feels big! So, okay, so here's the rule. So you have to catch a fish on five different JT rods, okay? So you can pick whichever five you want, but you have to have a fish on five rods. If you get one walleye on each one of the five rods, then it doubles your points for the day. Two X. Okay, so if you don't, if you just catch a fish on four rods, then you just don't get double. I mean, Then you no. get your number of fish straight out. You probably solidify second place if you do that. Real <laughs> solid. So, and, and then uh, one big fish, big fish is 25 points. Otherwise, uh, each walleye is a point. Okay. Anything over 20 is two points. Just put it on your clicker. Okay. That's it. And then the sixth rod is a bonus 50 points. <laughs> yeah, sixth rod. You know, yeah, if, you, yeah, if, you're, if, you're, if you're way down, then you can start making rules up. And I stuff, like so. that. Yeah. I like that. It's a good All plan. Right. So, I like that. So it's be C squared against D squared. Yep. Double Ds. Better than double Cs. Always. All right. Let's roll, buddy. You betcha. Good luck. Yeah. No, he's got another team. Here. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, 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 yeah, I'll give him a little. Oh. Oh. <laughs> 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 Well, let's turn it in. You're down one. Yeah. We won. Game over. <laughs> Solid effort, guys. We're working. We're working this one. Bring it back. Always the boat working this one. You almost feel like there's a couple individual seats. Well, there's these little, little rock fingers sticking out. Yep. Ooh. That's a better fish, Dee. Like it? You might need the net there. Okay, I'm going to get it. Not a good one, D. Yep, let's do her again. Hey, is that two points? That was two That's points. two points. Back at her. D, you got to be getting excited to go home. Oh, it's that time. We've seen that box on the way here this morning. Do you see those two? <laughs> oh, it's so weird. Got it. Holy slack in my line. I still felt it. There you go. Boom. Hey, Boom! Another double clicker for D. Double D is on the board. Yep. He's docked to come right off that ledge there. That that loop in your line is completely reversed. With that big grab, you can feel that thing coming down. I wonder if this might be a contest winner. We can't get a contest winner in on one of the first fishes. 25 clicks. 25 clicks. <laughs> click, 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 click. It's going to sound like a cash machine here. Woo! Wait, oh. right. Oh, yeah. Now it's. Hold that. Is it over 20? It's got to be just on there. I don't know, it could be two clicks. Oh, there's not oh, yeah. two of the penalty. 21 and a half, he's double clicker. No messing around, let's get back in the water, boys. He was coming off that edge. And literally trying to fight through about a four foot bowl in my line, but they're sitting on that spot right there. Yeah. 
gonna grab that jigging wrap and try it. They're t bone in it too. They, they want it. You always wonder, like, are they just like, are they just coming back in, or did they just stop biting for a while? Well, I think they, because they're they're hitting that thing hard now. They come in waves. We just didn't want to mess up any clicks. Yeah, take that fish. Looks like he's got a hot future right there. We got the. Uh, yep. Yeah, grab her. Then the bad one. Double clicker, maybe, huh? Double clicker. Boom. Well, I tell you what, everyone counts today. Absolutely, everyone boy. Everyone counts. She is a lot tougher conditions out here. Beauty. Beauty. Thanks, like this, bud. That's on the old 610s on her. Yeah. Cross it off the list. <laughs> there it is. Cross it off the list. 610 is actually a good rod for this for this bite here. Um, what happens is it got really, really cold. And the fish are getting a little bit finicky here, just kind of probably temporary during the day here. Um, but you know, a little lighter rod picks up a little lighter bite. And guess what? That's a clicker, Zoner. It is. That's a clicker. Oh, I get to click it too. Yeah, don't forget that. It's a pretty important. We need, part a, of the we need every click today. <laughs> hey, and that's the third rod. Jeez, that thing ran you down. It sure did. Holy, yeah. did that thing come way upstream. There he is. Oh. <laughs> Get him. Yeah. Get him the double. Boom. Nice. Now it's time to get the black rain back out. Time for numbers. That's right. We Let's got our do it. 2x. It's time for numbers. Perfect eater. We can give it a click. So Dylan and I, we're not exactly sure of the score, but we think we've got a little bit of a lead. So we're going to take this opportunity to kind of throw a Hail Mary. We've come down river a little bit. We're going to pull cranks right through the gut of the river. And uh, since we got this little lead, I, we're going we're gonna to sacrifice a little time, see if we can find a different pattern to cash in on today. What do you think, D? Well, I think that what's going on too is now we just left the prime spot where we've been jigging. So they're going to want to slide into that spot to hold it in Look case no other boats come into Look it. Look at them, they're moving And they're right already now. sliding into <laughs> it. So now what we get to do is we get to cover more water because we know the fish aren't biting there. So we're going to cover more water while they're going to hold the spot down. It's a strategic move and they don't even know it yet. Ah, <laughs> strategery wins. That one little spot in there, if you get just, just beyond, no, I think I got him. He's probably under 14 pounds. Just beyond that tree there, they're just sitting in that one little spot. It's just hard to get in there with that wind. You know, I did go, I went to that black rain too. Normally I prefer to fish that jig wrap with that 7-1, but that wind is so heavy. You just need just a little bit more backbone on that. Yeah. With this wind, it's, it, you gotta have that. Not a giant, but we'll take him. Yeah, click it. He's a clicker. Click it. Click it. Click it. Take it. We'll take it. Got it. Nice. Six rod. How's that feel? Tube sock. I don't think so. Fish. Fish. Boom. Oh, deep. Oh, deep. In the nice. boat. So, is there a bonus for six rods? No. Drag one. <laughs> <laughs> Too many weapons in your boat. Too many weapons. That's minus one point. <laughs> Just came up with that rule. <laughs> Gotta be creative. We said we make our rules as we go. Yeah, tough break, guys. Tough break. <laughs> Gotta know the rules, though. That one little spot in there. If you get just just beyond, no, I think I got him. He's probably under 14 pounds. 
just beyond that tree there, they're just sitting in that one little spot. It's just hard to get in there with that wind. You know, I did go, I went to that black rain too. Normally, I prefer to fish that jig wrap with that 7-1, but that wind is so heavy. You just need just a little bit more backbone on that. Yeah. With this wind, it's, it, you gotta have that. Not a giant, but we'll take him. Yeah, click it. He's a clicker. Click it. Click it. Click it. Take it. And a boat flipper. <laughs> Um, yeah, it ain't small. Right. Yeah. Probably not a oyster. Over the motors, yeah. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Nice fish. Boom! Good point there, thank you. Yeah, that Darn might be a two clicker, huh? Yeah, that's it. Oh, is that right? I don't mean to point out the obvious here, but somebody's getting kind of hot. <laughs> Boy, just pick that's it up. On, that's on the 7-3. That's on the 7-3. That's our bonus. You know, the 7-3 uh, the, uh, the JTX Big Light's probably not the ideal rod for what we're doing here. Uh, but we got our five rods covered now, and uh, I'll tell you what, nothing loads up like the 7.3 GTX Mag Lite. That thing is a heck of a lot of fun. Now, honestly, a 3.8 ounce jig, probably a little bit much for this rod, but we're into challenges. We're into challenges. Man, I can't believe these conditions. We've been fishing through rain, sleet, sideways snow, 45 mile an hour winds. It is cold, and the fish are biting. Fish on. D, when you're done with that, can you get a uh, little sunscreen on my back? It's <laughs> good fish, buddy. Is it? Yeah. Well, you were out there. Yeah. Hey, that's a better fish. Yeah, baby! Woo! That's what we were looking for. <laughs> That is not one on the clicker. <laughs> right in Mackie's sweet spot? Yeah. Mackie, if you want mine reeling in. Yeah, I found a little that. sweet spot. He says, if you, if you yeah. say that loud enough, you know Grandin's going to be boom, right there. <laughs> you haven't fished with him long enough to know this. Don't worry, he's fine. <laughs> We're fine. We're fine. Nothing to see here, guys. You just wait till he crosses over both your lines. <laughs> oh, for crying out loud. <laughs> or the straw. Brain buster. That's weird. Donnie had that happen too. Really? Just a minute ago, yep. Like completely busted. Huh. Well, those jigging wraps are cheap though. Yeah, yeah, that's the nice part about it. Yeah. Buy them by the baker's dozen. <laughs> Think it's much, but that's the board. Tube Sock City. It's on the board. We'll take it. One click. Little tiny feller. Right here. <laughs> Don't you worry. I know whose boat it'll hit. Just, hey, get the net. Hey, net. Yeah. He's a nice fish. You got there, Zane. Well, that's a two clicker. It ain't that big, a but it's a, clicker, it is a two clicker. Huh? Clicker, but it is a two clicker. Nice. That's nice fish. 
Two clicker? Hey, you agree? Yeah. Well, I don't know. I don't have a tape measure. Well, I know, but you tell me. If you said okay, I would go. <laughs> yeah. That's a head shake. That's a good fish. Everyone knows double D's is better than double C's. <laughs> Jeez. This thing's got some shows. <laughs> it's going to be a pretty nice sucker. <laughs> Look at the lips on her. Send this mama home. Jeez. Winner, boy. <laughs> Look at how fast that thing is. Look at that. <laughs> if you're gonna catch Look one, catch that one. <laughs> Check out the girth on that thing. <laughs> hey, cross the black rain off the list, buddy. Yeah. There's one on the rain. Rain down, baby. Nice fish. Look at that. Just lift them too. Perfect. Look at how heavy that is. Oh, that's a big fish. But I'm not gonna get too excited. We're going after another one. contest here and uh, it was really fun we actually had to use uh, several different JT rods and you couldn't actually progress to the next rod until you caught a fish on the first rod so after all that I will say that the 7-1 JTX seems like it's the most versatile rod within our lineup and I'd like to thank Donnie here obviously a real stiff competition you and Dylan did a tremendous job I'd like to congratulate you on that nice second place finish we will gladly take second place finish uh, the most versatile rod for our team, I think, was the 6.9 Black Rain. We scored a lot of points pitching jigs and plastics. And with ripping wraps, we did pretty well. So, uh, tip of the cap to C squared. I would watch your back next year. We're going to have a second edition of this, folks. Stay tuned. Stay tuned.